giving you your own special introduction, so I would like to know, uh, Lawrence, tell us about your character in oh, Jack I'm, and the Dean I'm Star. a Dean Trot, and I have two sons, uh, Jack, who you can see alongside me there, and my other son, a little bit embarrassing really, is Simon. Now, some people will taunt him and call him Simple Simon. I just call him Thick. <laughs> but the apple of my eye is my little buttercup. I loves her. She just gives me so much fa- affection. And she just makes my life complete. Whereas Jack and Simon don't really fulfill me because at the present moment in time I'm a widower you see so I I have two fellas who are trying to court me that uh, I know locally uh, I'll just give them a shout out here hello there Kevin you little sweet cheek little fella you and Jamie oh you've got lovely big ears haven't you oh yes you have <laughs> yes well you can come and see me on the uh, St. Henry stage from the 2nd through to the 9th of December, where the village of Much Twittering will be transported into the St. Henry Centre, and I will be there. It's a nice little village, really, you know. We have some people we don't like to talk to. I don't want to mention any names, really, but Andy Whitmore, you're one of them, okay? <laughs> so uh, that's basically me, Dame Dotty Trat, and I, I have a, a, a dairy. Dame, I think that's what you need to know. Dame Dotty, I am delighted to meet you and thank you for giving us a little sneak preview of uh, your... Po- yes, round of applause. Please, round of applause. Um, I should obviously mention the fact, though, that today you're in, uh, let's just say, your cash today. Um, yes. What can we expect from you with regards to your outfit? I'm guessing it's something pretty fabulous. Well, every, every, every day I have to go up Sneefell and wash my hair in a stream just so I can flick it like it. well you don't see that on the radio do you I flick it like that <laughs> and it's, a, it's lovely hair I have uh, it's beautiful you pr- probably can't see it at the present moment in time because I'm on the radio but I uh, let's just say I'm a fuller figure lady who uh, <laughs> knows where it's at and uh, sometimes I go there I love this. Uh, Lisa, this is adorable because, first of all, we're getting our own little private show here. We are, yeah. Uh, from Jack and the Beanstalk. In case you just tuned in, by the way, uh, that was a little performance by the Dame from Jack and the Beanstalk, which is on uh, the Peel Centenary Centre from the 2nd of December. Uh, what I love, Lisa, is that you're saying that for all of these years you've been doing Peel Panto, uh, Dame Trot, a.k.a. Lawrence, mm-hmm. is essentially known as Mum to you yes, all. Yes, so we all, we all call Lawrence Mum. We don't call him Lawrence. It's Mum. It's very rare. If we call him Lawrence, he knows he's done something wrong. Um, but the majority of the time, he, we call him Mum. Um, I think the majority of the principals that have been in it for years have had the experience of Lawrence being our mother. Um, and it is Kaylee's first year experiencing Lawrence as Mum. As actual Mum. As yeah. actual Mum. I've been here seven years. Your first this is my first mum. Oh, uh, well, I, you couldn't have a better mum today. I know. You know, she's quite fabulous, isn't she? Um, okay, then I'm <laughs> going to come to you, Kaylee. Tell us a little bit about what we can expect from Jack and the Beanstalk this year. Ooh. See, I, as much as it's traditional, once again, like we always try and do, we try and break the traditions with, whilst keeping it in line and making it what people expect. We also like to kind of push the expectations a bit. Um, we try and include different dancing, different music, things you wouldn't necessarily expect to hear. For example, Keep On Moving. It's not really a song you'd think would be in a show. We've put it in a show. We've made it work. We've got a dance routine to it. You um, were dancing in the background, I should have said. It was brilliant. It's a shame you all couldn't see this, but while we were listening to Five, you were practicing your dance we routine. We were. We were. Yeah, so, I mean, as as Lawrence has very kindly already explained quite a lot of the story, we are in much Twittering, which is our home. Not Xing. No. Twitter X. No, okay. No, I know. <laughs> I see what you did there. You're very clever, like I try. I try, Dame Trot. I try. Uh, so you're much Twitter. Yeah, so, and it, and it, so it's a bit of a kind of classic, but very modern. It's You're yeah. bringing it into the modern eye, bring it into modern day, which is great. And Liam, you've obviously there's just four of you here at uh-huh. the moment, but you have a, a, a cast of many. Tell us about the cast. We do, yeah. We've got... Um, uh, some familiar names. We've also got some new names and faces uh, that have joined us this year. Uh, William and Hannah, uh, they've come uh, uh, along and joined us. Um, and we've got new teens and we've got our old teens or teens that weren't teens last year that are teens this year. 
we've got so many of them. Um, what we've got 21 chorus members split over two groups. We've got seven main in, seven in our main chorus line. They're our team giant. Um, and yeah, I mean, we've got, uh, can I shout out to everybody? Uh, we've got Victoria as Simple Simon. We've got Duncan. We've got Amy. We've got Sarah. We've got Dave uh, as Flesh Creep. Uh, Lisa's Princess Rose. We've got William and Hannah as the King and Queen. We have a fairy lemur. Chambers and Buttercup the Cow. Buttercup the Cow, who's a, a favourite. And it is on the Centenary Centre from the 2nd to the 10th of December. And uh, you've got a charity um, attached to it as well, haven't you? That something's very close to your heart, actually, Liam. Yes, Autism in Man. <laughs> I had to think then. I didn't write that on my notes. Yes, Autism in Man. Uh, we will be raising money for them at the end of each uh, show. Um, and it, it really uh, it means a lot to us this year because uh, as director, I get to steal the forms of all the people that are applying to um, audition and what's been what's been amazing to me this year is 17 out of a cast of about 40 um, are, are in some way shape or form neurodivergent um, and that's a, that's a lot of people mm -hmm. uh, with a lot of different outlooks on life and uh, different perceptions on life so uh, working with all those people and no one nobody knows anybody else's you know we are just ourselves when we turn up and that's all that matters um which is just what makes it so amazing um because we are just we're just ourselves we're peel pantaloons yes, we are. We are. <laughs>